Hi Vogue, I'm Rosie Huntington-Whiteley and this is my Fresh Face Glow. I often don't have a lot of time in the morning but I need to look polished and glam before I leave the house. And these are really the steps that I will always go to. I always like to start by applying a lip balm. Usually I'm doing my makeup for 10, 15 minutes and this really gives my lips time to kind of soak in all of the moisture from the lip balm. Next I'm gonna take a really creamy concealer and I'm going to apply it where I feel like I need a little bit of coverage. And then I'm gonna take a brush and I'm just going to blend into the skin. Every makeup artist will always have you look up, it means that you can really work the concealer right up to the rim of your eye. Being a model for the last 16 years, I've been lucky enough to work with some of the best of the best in the industry. I get to sit down in the hair and makeup chair with all these incredible artists and having been in the industry now for so long, there's so much I've managed to pick up along the way. I will rarely, rarely leave the house without always putting a little eyebrow gel through my eyebrows. And I'm not being too precious about them really. I just want them to look natural and groomed. Next thing I like to use is like a foundation powder. I love that it does give me full coverage, but in a really natural, luminous way. And I always like to bring it down onto my neck just to make sure that it's all blended. There's been plenty of days where I've left the house in a rush and a kind friend has pointed out that I have a tide mark of foundation or concealer or powder or bronzer. So once I've done my loose foundation, I really love to apply a luminous finishing powder. You know, making my skin look more glowy, more luminous. That's definitely the look that I'm always going for. So now I'm just adding a little bit of bronzer. It's going to sort of softly contour and you can see the difference this side is with the bronzer and this side is without. One of my favorite tips as well is bringing it into the eye socket. This is a great way of doing a lazy girl eyeshadow. I'm a busy girl, I'm on the go, I'm traveling a lot, I'm a new mum, and so I really am all about cutting corners when it comes to makeup. I wanna look fresh and polished, but in as little time as possible. I'm going to take a cream blush. Just apply to the apples of the cheeks and then blend out with my ring finger and my middle finger. I always like to pop a little bit into the socket of my eye, which looks kind of crazy till I blend it out. And it pulls the color in from your cheek in a really natural, cohesive way. So for me, a fresh-faced glow is all about adding radiance and highlights. I always like to apply highlighter as one of my final steps because I can really just see where I want that added bit of glow and radiance. My second to last step would be to do my lip. I want a little bit of color on my lips, but I still want them to look natural. And now that I'm applying it, I can see that I could probably amp it up a little bit. So I'm gonna use a darker color. And actually one thing I always do is anything that's left on my finger, I'll just pop onto the cheek. And that just pulls the colors all together that you're using. Okay, so the last step is really applying like a dewy finishing mist um, across my whole face waft. Okay, so there you have it guys. That is my fresh faced glow. Thanks for watching. And if you want to see more videos like this, you can you can subscribe at the bottom. <laughs>